This Stark and Tuscarawas County Real Estate Home Sellers Updates are brought to you by Mary Losey, Realtor at Cutler Real Estate. The demand for residential listings is way high and the supply is way low. Now, when we look at the month's supply of inventory, you can see we are at the lowest point in 10 years. In fact, the chart looks like a steep mountain's descent. In 2008, there was an 11 month supply of homes available for sale. This month, there is a record low 3.7 months of housing available. That's 15.7% less than last year at this time and 28% less supply than 2013. Now that's indicating a demand. What does the month's supply of inventory mean? If no other houses would be listed and put on the market, then all of the inventory would be gone in 3.7 months. In other words, the current demand of buyers would swallow up the entire housing inventory in 3.7 months. A normal healthy housing month supply of inventory is five to six months and anything below five to six months is a seller's market. Anything above six months is a buyer's market. Right now is the best chance of getting sellers the best deal possible. If demand is high and supply is low, it's time to sell now. Most sellers are thinking spring is the time to sell, but all indicators are saying spring has already sprung from the home buyer's side. Buyers are out there. They get it. Prices are going up. Interest rates are about to go up. It's time to buy right now. Buyers aren't waiting until spring. Smart sellers are not waiting for spring. The National Association of Realtors just came out with a report that the three months that the most listings come on the market is April, May, and June. And the 10 specific dates most houses get listed per day are April 1st, 10th, and 11th, May 1st, 2nd, 9th, 15th, 16th, and 30th, and June 6th, with six of these days in May. If sellers wait, they are just waiting for more competition. Smart sellers will get their homes listed now and sell before May. Contact Mary Losey today by calling 330-323-2975, emailing marylosey at gmail.com, or visiting her on the web at www.marylosey.com.